All right, the next part is the, the mirror tool. Um, you'll see I've already done the, the very first part uh, of building the extrusion. And then I um, added the fillets and drilled a 0.375 hole. Um, so the mirror, if you have something that's symmetrical or you, want, you have something on one side of an object and you want to mirror across the other side, um, that would allow you to do that without building it twice. So it's a very powerful tool. Um, so first we'll click the mirror tool and then we'll select the features. Now you can select the features either by clicking at them or you can also select them by clicking the features in the browser. In this case we're actually mirroring everything. The next thing you have to select is the mirror plane. What actually are you going to mirror? Um, what are you going to mirror across? We're going to mirror across that face. So once we click that face, we notice that the part gets um, doubles in size, and now we have a symmetrical part where well, one side becomes the next uh, mirrored across the other side. Okay, so that's just a very short explanation of the mirror tool. Uh, you can also use that um, as a feature or in, in the sketch, but again, I usually like to mirror features. That way, if you change, modify something, um, it modifies everything. So that's the, the mirror.